homesteading to prepping to common horse sense, we are College Hill Farm. Welcome back to College Hill Farm. Well, today we're going to show you, you saw us cut a post, how to quickly dig a post hole. Now I'm going to show you how to set a post without using concrete. Now this is the end post on my grape arbor trellis. So this post is going to have some pressure pulling on it from the grape arbor. So in order to keep it from over time leaning, I need to do something to make that post stout. Well, I don't want to spend money on concrete. Plus, if I wind up having to replace a post or pull a post up, there's a lot of digging involved to get that concrete out of there. So I don't want to do that. I don't want to spend the money on it, and I don't want to have to dig up concrete. So, I'm going to key this post. And uh, let me show you what to do. First off, you're going to need one of these. This is called a tamping bar. It's got an end here. And on this end, it's got a cutter. Uh, it's just a steel heavy bar. Uh, I found this at a uh, flea market for 12 bucks, so you can't beat that. So I've got the post in the hole, and you got to be careful, look out for these uh, thorns. That's a right there's a thorn off of that. Don't know how well you can see it, but there's a thorn off of it. You have to be careful, those things will give you a bad day. There's another one. They're all over it. They'll give you an absolutely bad day. But uh, I'm going to go ahead, get the dirt in the ground, and then I'll show you how to key this post. Well, get in there. Aggravating me. At this point, that post is pretty solid, but the truth is it's not nearly as solid as it needs to be because if I push it real hard, it'll lean a little. And with that wire on it, over time, it will keep pulling and pulling and pulling and pulling until it starts to just lean over. 
Well, I want to stop that, and here's how. When I cut that post, I also cut this short length of, uh, again, it's locust, the short length of locust. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this in in the direction of the pull of the wire, and I'll let you see how I'm going to do it. Now what will happen is as this post pulls forward, it will hit that stick. Now the harder this ground gets, the stronger that will hold. It will push against that stick and make the post kick out at the bottom, which there's no room to kick out at the bottom. So that's the way you put in a post without having to use concrete. And when it pushes against it, it'll just push it down further anyway. See, I can put my weight on it and that post is not moving. Just to show you, it's keyed on this side the side that this part of the post is on. If I pull, I'm a big old boy, 300 pounds. That post ain't moving. Now, if you like this kind of stuff, this homestead and do-it-yourself kind of thing, be certain to come on out to the channel and subscribe. We do this homestead and stuff every week, sometimes one sometimes five videos. Just depends on what's going on in the homestead. If you click the little bell, it'll notify you when we upload a video. We upload every Sunday. And now, with that being said, it's time for me to get on to the next thing.